Hezbollah doubled the size of its missile arsenal in 2020 and has the entire territory of Israel inside the range of its precision missiles, the movement's Secretary General Saeed Hassan Nasrallah declared on December 27th. Any target across the area of occupied Palestine that we want to hit accurately, we are able to hit accurately, Nasrallah said. The Hezbollah leader also claimed that flights of Israeli drones in Lebanese skies reflect the confusion of Tel Aviv. The flight of Zionist drones in Lebanon's airspace shows a strong fear of the response by the resistance. The Israelis know that we fired the right weapon at their drones without disclosing it, he said. Nasrallah also said that the US-backed normalization agreements between several Arab states and Israel were not surprising since most of the Arab regimes used to sell the Palestinians only words. These agreements, Nasrallah said, only helped to end a period of hypocrisy and indicated that the masks have fallen and that the real nature of the leadership of these states has been exposed. Just a few days ago, on December 25th, the Israeli Air Force struck several targets in Syria, claiming that the strike hit Iranian and Hezbollah-affiliated targets. According to Syrian sources, the main target was the defense factories in the Misyaf region. Meanwhile, Israeli media reported that Tel Aviv sent a submarine towards the Persian Gulf as a warning message to Iran. The move followed a recent deployment of a U.S. Navy nuclear submarine in the Gulf made under the same pretext. Israeli and U.S. sources have already claimed that Iran is preparing attacks on their forces in the Middle East and threaten it with a military response.